All right, so it's a uh, I'm out here in the watermelons. Got to go all the way. See those hives over there? Got to go all the way over there. But I just kind of wanted to talk to y'all a little bit. Um, this is not an easy thing to do. Um, we, well, I kind of messed up and thought this road went down. But anyway, I'm going to have to cross over. Uh, we've tried to get into doing this for a while. Um, we did it a few years ago. We did pumpkins a few years ago. Um, we made a lot of mistakes. Had some issues. Um, needless to say, we did not go back to the pumpkins. We, uh, we kind of lost ourselves on that one. But, you got, we learn from our mistakes and everything. Definitely reach out to your different farmers if you're interested in doing this. If you got a tractor with some forks, it'd help out. I know plenty of people who do this and everything's by hand, hand truck, that type stuff. Uh, the farmers need it, even though they act like they don't want it. Um, a lot of noticed the younger generation, I guess, my generation, which is 40s and say below, 50s and below, I would say, kind of understand a little more that you need them. Not saying that the older generation doesn't, but especially in my area they're so used to well there's bees always around they don't understand that they are the wild colonies are not out there like it used to be so reach out to them let them know what's going on let them know you're available you might not get this year's contract but you might get next year's um just reach out if you can't do it and they would come out and talk to you if you can't do it reach out to a beekeeper that either can help you do it or that could take that contract and help that out um it looks looks good on both parties uh, i'm just kind of rambling on right now but I'm going for this walk i'm getting ready to release these bees so I'm not going to record that because they are angry because they went for a two hour ride and then they joddled around on that bobcat. And... But anyway, like I said, it's just kind of rambling. So it's kind of food for thought. Anyway, we'll see you around.